Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. If it's your first time, thank you for stopping by. Today I'm coming to you with a video that I saw on YouTube. I will post the young lady who I um, saw this with from YouTube. She made um, had a canvas and she printed out a silhouette of a young lady face and she used these spoons these spoons right here um, from the Dollar Tree and she had a canvas I let you know the size I'm not sure right now of this size that I have right here and you could use the paint of your choice and she covered hers even though the canvas is white she still used another white on top so I'm gonna do the same thing try to do exactly what she did and I just got my foam brush and I have a little foam little I didn't have no plates huh <laughs> so excuse that right there but I'm gonna pull my paint in here I'm gonna paint this and then I'm gonna I already found this on Google I traced it and um cut it out with vinyl and I'm gonna put it on to my canvas like this Hope you can see this this is how it's going to be laid on my canvas then you take the spoon let me show you y'all know I like quick videos so I got four packs of these spoons and all you're going to do is take the spoon and just bend it and it breaks very easy and you hold on to these these you can make flowers with these I saw her do that but anyway you're gonna use these for her hair so it would be on here like this and then you're gonna start building her hair so let me get this painted and after it dries we're gonna start building our hair Remember to subscribe, like, hit the bell to be notified the next time I come on. And um, I hope you enjoy this. It's my first time. And um, let's do this together. So I just pulled my paint in there. And I'm just going to start painting. I ain't gonna let you watch all this, but I want you to see. Let me just paint it. I'm going in one direction. I bought my paint from um, Hobby Lobby, but they also have it at Michael's. So I ain't gonna bore you with this part right here. So let me finish painting this. Okay, I'm done painting. Also did my sides. And the good thing about this, I got the little thing back here. You can hold it while you're painting. And um, it don't take long to dry. So I'm going to let this dry. And in the meanwhile, I'm going to finish snapping my spoons. It don't take long, y'all. Okay, now my canvas have dried. Like I said, I painted it. Now I'm getting ready to stick my picture on here. First, let me get it off of here. You just rub this real. I like to rub the back. Uh, you can, I don't have my squeegee up here, but let's see. I rubbed it good enough. Nope. So, the next best thing, if you don't have your squeegee in hand, just use a credit card. It's time to go over it. Also, do the back. I 
like so. And go slowly, make sure everything is down on your transfer paper. Yay. Then you want to take it and make sure you center it. Put it in the center. Because when you start building your hair on there, you don't want too much there, then you can't put too much hair. You might want to add more. I'm doing my best to center it. Take it, put that right on there, like so. Instead of using things off of Google, I'm gonna use my daughter picture or my grandkids and make them my next one. But uh, this is my first one, so yeah. I'm gonna skip now. Once you get it going, it should be pretty good. But... Okay, go. Don't go straight down. Kind of pull it to the side. And the paper, the printable vinyl I'm using, this one is by, let me, let me see. it's Cricut. And they, I noticed their vinyl is, their permanent vinyl is really thin. But I like it too. But I'm, I, my number one vinyl that I like to deal with is by Stalls. I love their products. So, and I just tried this out the Cricut because I was in Hobby Lobby. But I love Stahl's um, products. Okay, little nose, stay there. Excuse me, y'all. You know you can keep your transfer paper. I'm gonna just stick it on here. And you can reuse this. Yep, you can reuse that. You didn't I didn't you didn't need that much to be exposed because it lint and all that stuff could get on it. But um yeah. If you you can use that again. So that's how it is. And then you get your hot glue gun and start building your hair. And what you're gonna do, you're gonna glue the tip there and there. Just going down the side of her face <laughs> straight down I just put three right here and you could break these you could use a wire cutter to make them shorter but I just took it and broke it with my hand be kind of careful because the other side will start coming apart but see I just broke it to make it shorter and always place it, see how I want to put it.
put it in there. Always just I put a little see where I'm I lay it where I'm gonna put it at first then I just go on and add my little glue. You know, when I'm doing stuff, I'm kind of quiet. I don't say too much. Some people go do stuff that I, I really be into what I'm doing. So I kind of concentrate and I don't talk a lot. I'm sorry about that. But yeah, so you see what I'm doing. And you can use other pictures. It don't have to be this one. I just used this one. This is the first one I saw that she did. Um... Yeah, so I'm going to finish doing that, and I'll be back. Was it even taping? Oh, yeah. Okay, now I'm adding my end of my spoons. And I just add a little glue. Remember, I saw someone else. I didn't invent this or anything. So, trying to make sure I'm doing this right. But y'all watch me at real time do this. <laughs> One second. I just hope I'm doing it right. Before my glue gets dry. I use the back. I believe she's using the back also of the spoon. And I bought this glue at the dollar store. Okay, that's not even sticking. So you really gotta make sure you hurry up and put it down. Cause that wasn't even sticking at all. And the glue that I found is this right here. And it has glitter. So that's cool because the spoon is silver. You got the, if you can see that. Hope I'm doing it right. And it has glitter. So that's cool. So let me finish adding my spoons. I'll be right back. Okay, y'all, I'm done. I'm sorry. I thought I was taping all that time, and I was not taping. So I'm explaining what I did. I, like I said, I found someone on YouTube who did this, and she expired me, so I did one. And what I did up here in the corner, just to put a little decoration up there, I put a little stone there and some, in the spoons and right there. And I added, that's my little bowl right there. And I just added more little stones on there, see, like that. And added some stones like she did and I love it I think it came out pretty for my first one and I'm going to be doing another one um, of my granddaughter face because you can't switch the faces up you can use your own face or whatever so yeah what y'all think comment below subscribe hit the video I mean hit the like button let me know how you um, like what I did and 
continue to look out for videos that I'll be posting, trying to get better at posting them at least once a week. But I do so much, it's kind of like, ooh, hard getting in there. But I'm going to do my best this year. But, um, yeah, thank you. And I'm going to try to, um, I know the lady that does it. The name of her channel is, oh, my God. I got to figure it out. I'm sorry. Bleem Meets Me, I think. I find, Don't worry about it. I'm putting it in my description below so you um could check her out. She do a lot of beautiful things. Okay. See you later. Subscribe, like, hit the bell so you'll be notified. And let me know how I'm doing, y'all, by hitting that like bell. Everyone stay safe. Wear your mask.